A super fun Mother's Day weekend vlog in New York City. Honestly, just like my perfect weekend in New York. But first, I want to thank today's sponsor, which is Ebby. I feel like I talk about this a lot on my channel, on the podcast. I don't love to wear bras because I find them to be very uncomfortable. But recently, I've had a lot of like tops, specifically like seamless looking t shirts or tank tops that I've been wanting to wear that. I'm needing bras for and I have found some amazing bras from Ebby. So this one right here is the nude relief bra. This is so comfortable. First of all, you can take out the cups. They have removable cups if you want. I have them in because I feel like it just gives a really nice shape. And in the back, of course, they have the hook and eye closure. So you're still able to like adjust it to how you want it. The adjustable straps as well. I also like how it has a plunging neckline. So if you were to wear like a lower cut top or a v-neck of sorts you can still wear this and you don't like see it um and i really like this color it goes really nicely under a tank top i've been looking for nice bras to wear under tank tops in specific because i just love to wear like tank tops and jeans so i'm very 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 grateful that i found this bra and this actually has a wireless underwire so you get the same lift that you would a normal wired bra but you get the comfort of without and the band is supposed to mold to your body, which is really nice. So it just makes it extra comfortable. And then this right here is my new bestie. This is the wireless bralette. Again, you can take out the cups if you want. It is just so comfortable. Like they have other colors, of course, but I usually go for the nude. This is what it looks like in the back. It's so stretchy, so comfortable, but also stays on your body so nicely. Like I put this on and it's just a dream. Like this is so perfect if you're wearing like a sweater or something or even under a tank top. This just looks so good and it just shapes nicely. That's like one thing I'm trying to up my game. I'm trying to up my bra game because I've been just like not wearing bras and it's just not working anymore. So we are going with Ebby. So for reference, by the way, I'm a size small in these. They are 100% committed to making sure you get the perfect fit, no problem. So it's easy to return and exchange. And it also ha it has this slip proof technology right here. So it sticks to your skin. It stays where it needs to. And it just feels so good. And I just love how it looks. I also value a nice panty. And these are so nice specifically because there's this lining just around the top. So your underwear doesn't move around. Like I hate when thongs move around and you just have a massive wedgie. That is not the case with these right here. Again, they're just a nice nude color and they stick to your skin because of this. It's almost like, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just like a little bit more textured so it actually stays. And I have another really cute pink color as well, fun for the spring and summer. All in all, I just love that with Ebby, I'm not constantly readjusting my undergarments, whether it's down or it's up. I hate that, that's why I don't like to wear them, but these actually stay what they need to be, so I don't have to worry about that. I'm gonna give you guys 15% off site-wide and free shipping by using my code Danielle Carolyn FS 15 So I'll have the link down below to the products that I showed you guys today. Highly suggest you guys give it a go because again, I wouldn't be telling you this if I didn't like it. I literally was like, let me try out these bras, see what the hype's all about, and I get it. So um, if you're kind of in that same journey as me, maybe you should try out Ebby. So my mom is literally about to be here. She's on her way from the airport right now. So I'm gonna get a little bit more presentable and we're gonna go open the door for her. Oh my God. Hello. Hello. She's arrived. Oh, yay. Oh, what a cute you in your denim skirt. Welcome to Hotel Danielle. Hello, you guys. Hello, mom. Hi. I'm with my girl again. Yay. We're having a Mother's Day weekend. She just flew up. It's Thursday. And she's really getting the full Danielle New York weekend. Oh, 100%. So, so excited. We have a packed itinerary, but also like lots of free time. So it's okay. But we're starting out Thursday. We're headed to dinner with Ryan. He's meeting us. We're going to Ombra in West Village. And then for a special request, we're going to Comedy Cellar. Yes, because I want to laugh. She wants to laugh. <laughs> so, okay, we're going to go, but let's do a little out for the night. Okay. Ta -da. Love this. I didn't know some boutique. Boston proper jeans and 
my comfy walking shoes. Heck yeah, I love it. And then this is my outfit of the night. I finally don't need a jacket. Oh, do you need to wear a jacket? Do you want to feel outside and see? Oh yeah. You just put the iron out. This bodysuit is from the brand Shop Ambitionist. All of her bodysuits, I just met the owner the other day. Her stuff is so soft, so comfortable. I'll have it linked below. I also have them on my LTK. Jeans, our girlfriend denim, it's like those pairs of jeans that I feel like just really snatch it in. Belt is Orium Collective. I think by the time this vlog is up, my Electric Picks collaboration is out. So the secret is out. I did a huge jewelry collaboration with Electric Picks, a jewelry brand that I love and wear on my own. And I'm wearing the earrings. These are the Finley earrings and I'm also wearing the Avenue necklace. But go check out my Instagram because we did like a whole promo shoot at a hotel. Cause you guys know promo, Sounds of the city, am I right? We did a whole promo shoot because you guys know I love hotels. A lot of people thought I was doing some sort of hotel collaboration. I also have this right here, which is the Danielle cuff. It's so good. And then the idea is that you're layering. So this right here is the It Girl necklace. It looks so good layered with this. And then this one is the Carolyn necklace. I'll show you guys more in detail. I just realized that I can finally talk about it probably by the time this vlog is up. And it's a horseshoe and a four leaf clover because Carolyn is Irish, luck of the Irish, all the things. And then I have another pair of earrings as well. These are, might be my favorite. They're the Montauk earrings. They're a little starfish, like so perfect for summer. They're very approachable. They're not too big and I'm so grateful. So you can go shop on Electric Picks now. Go check out my Instagram. We're doing a giveaway on there. So yeah, good stuff. But um, yeah, did I go through my whole outfit? I'm wearing black boots as well. And we're gonna go to dinner and have a little Thursday night. Yes, we are. And I am a little chilly, so. She needs something. a jacket. So we're gonna get her a jacket. What are we thinking? Oh, that could be good. I didn't, I forgot I owned that. It goes nice with the top. She needs a light jacket. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, that's It's good. chic, the coloring's nice. Yes, yeah, that's mm. great. Such good dinner. Now we're going to Comedy Cellar and I just realized they might take my camera away because they take your phones because they don't want you to record. So it might be goodbye for now, but it's the most beautiful Thursday night in New York. Literally everyone's just walking around. My mom is like, wow, it's Thursday night. And there's so many people. What'd you guys think? It's so fun. It's so funny. It's so funny. Yeah. I love when my mom visits because I wake up and all the fruit in my fridge is presented so nicely. I see she got into the green tea. <laughs> I love it. Good morning, everybody. It's Friday morning. And like I said, we're giving mom the full New York City Danny experience. So she's coming to a New York Pilates class. She's a yoga instructor. I'm not worried about her. At all, I'm putting a little Divi scalp serum in my hair because I'm just gonna do a slick high bun That's been my go-to for Pilates because you lay your head down a lot So if I have a back bun, it just keeps hitting the bottom The back so I'm doing like a high kind of ballerina bun if you will comedy seller was so fun last night I met so many of you guys. It's so funny, like everyone I met was like, I came here because you always talk about it. And I was like, I wonder if Danielle will be there. And then they're like, no, she definitely won't. And then I was just simply there. That's how often <laughs> I go. Because my mom was like, I made the whole itinerary for the weekend. And she's like, okay, love, but where's Comedy Cellar? And I was like, that was a missight on my part or an oversight on my part. So we went and you can look up the comedians beforehand, but like, I don't usually because I like to be surprised. I pretty much know all the comedians at this point. Last night there were like two new ones that I didn't know, which was exciting. Wait, why am I doing that? But anyways, Delaney, I guess, looked beforehand and she didn't tell me, but my favorite comedian ever, his name is Lenny Marcus. Like, I love him. He's just so funny. I'm trying to be better about washing my face in the morning. So we're gonna use some Tasha. And she was the person at the end who was the last comedian and she looked at me and she's like, look! And I was like, oh my god. And he's so funny. My mom and I were roaring. He did a whole bit about like reusable grocery bags. The best. 
the got best. Your bag? It's like, do you got your bag? Like your husband's walking out the door. It's like, did you get the bag? He's like, I don't want a bag. But like, what if you get groceries? You need a bag. And it was so funny. Yeah, I'm trying to get better about washing my face in the morning because when I got a facial recently, and now I'm using my essence, she was like, think about it, you have all of this product on your face the night before, like skincare, and then you go to put more skincare on in the morning, but it has nowhere to go because the product from last night's there. And so I was like, all right. Now I'm putting on essence, and the way she explained the essence is, if you take a dry sponge and you put soap on it, it doesn't soak. The, the sponge needs to be wet first. So that's where essence comes in. It's just something to kind of wet your skin before you put on the rest of your product. I'm gonna use this Kopari vitamin C. I got this yesterday, I'm really excited. It has cute little beads in it, it has star fruit in it. It's supposed to be really brightening. I just love skincare, it's so fun. I don't know why you're vibing music in the morning. I have to, like I wake up and I turn on music with some Skin Fix Barrier Serum to protect the barrier because I live in New York City. And that'll be the extent of my skincare before Pilates. Put a little on my arms, why not? I'm just wearing this little onesie. Got my grippy socks, gave my mom some. So it's supposed to rain. So I'm gonna use this jacket as my little raincoat because it's also 50, so it's kind of cold. I love this little thing. It's from Lululemon. It's not super warm, but I feel like it's perfect for 50 and maybe rain because there's a hood and it's ginormous. It's my little sleeping bag jacket. How cute with my little a little bag, I feel like a little, just NYC girl. <laughs> it immediately just started raining, but we're prepared. <laughs> I'm so excited, yeah. we're having like a little morning. So Maybe fun. we should go get my favorite smoothie after. Ooh, love that. Or we can get breakfast. Oh. Got him, oh, I was just making sure. <laughs> I was making sure there's no cars. Oh. See, I'm just using it as my guide dog. <laughs> yeah, she's using me. She's like, take me where I need to go. She goes, oh my gosh, this is so New York. So New York. So Why funny. is it New York? Just like the lights, just the so decor. Light. Everything is just done to the nth degree. You know. She did a post Pilates walking through the Union Square Green Market. We're not really gonna buy anything, but it's fun to look. Very nice. Okay, even though I don't look much different, we did come back and shower. I changed into a different black outfit to continue on with the fun day we are gonna go to dry bar get our hair done even though it's not raining it really the rain's been holding up but we're gonna get our dry bar our blowouts for the weekend so we have fun girls night tonight with some of my friends and then my mom is getting her first lash lift and tint i'm so excited i am also of course getting my i go every two and a half months i think so we lift the lashes, we tint them, and I also get a little micro, or micro lighting, no. Dermaplane, dermaplaning. My mom's really excited. She's posting things on Instagram right now. Yeah, I know. Cause you know, it's a little cool like that. Hey, I mean, my eye peeps are gonna get accentuated. Yes, and we're gonna get blowouts. We're gonna come back here, so stunning. And then we're gonna get ready for our girls night out. Will I ever make it? Yes, because I will do a meditation in between all of this. You will make it. And when you get your lashes done, you can fall asleep if you want. Like you could just take a nap. It's pretty nice. So we're gonna head over and I'm excited. Blowout is done. I always tell them the straight up with rounded ends and she crushed it. I'm so happy and I hope the humidity doesn't rain or doesn't ruin it because it's so good. Got our blowout. I took a picture of you in those. Okay. And now we're at Warby Parker. All right, mom's turn. Got Michelle, two Michelles here. <laughs> Lashes on fleek, skin on fleek. We did the dermaplane. Back now, as you can see, lashes are done. Um, we had a little moment though. My mom, um, she's out grabbing, she wanted to go to the grocery store and grab a couple things. But um, she went to lay down to do her lash lift and tint. She like wasn't nervous at all, um, but she's like so sensitive and she's never done any, like no Botox, no, she doesn't really get facials. Like she doesn't do a lot of things to her face. Definitely not her lashes or like brows. Like she doesn't do any of that. And so I think she literally immediately, like as soon as she put the shield on her lid and started putting her eyelashes on my mom i've never seen her she literally was like convulsing i was like are you okay she's like i'm just so sensitive like she has such good energy but like i 
like I'm not used to someone touching my face, which I feel like is so normal. Like I remember when I used to get lash extensions, those made me bug out every time because it was just like even longer and even more just really up in your grill. I've just gotten so used to getting my lashes lifted. Um, I was like, mom, we do not have to do this. And Michelle who does lashes, she's so nice and so calming. My mom was like, thank God you're who you are because if my mom hit, she was like, if I had just gone to someone random, maybe I would have been really freaking out, but she felt so comfortable with Michelle and me there. And I was, she was like, I'm here though. I'm like, but like, why put yourself through that? So um, we ended up, she just stopped. She hadn't started putting the like um, product on her lashes yet. She was just putting her lashes on the shield. Um, so we stopped and it was totally fine, you know? And she was like, now I have closure cause she's always so curious about lash lifts and now she knows she wouldn't like it anyway. So I just made another decaf cuppa and I'm sitting down, <laughs> it's Friday and I feel like I'm so behind on stuff. Everyone, I'm just so popular today. I'm getting lots of texts, lots of emails today. So I feel like usually Fridays, I'm still working and stuff, but I feel like Fridays usually everyone like isn't around and I'm like, hello, but today everyone's up, up and at them. So I love it though. I love it. I love it so much. I'm like working on so many fun things. So I'm really happy to dive into it and kind of tie everything in a nice little bow before the weekend. Um, Cause now it's 5.45 and my mom and I don't have dinner until 8.30 tonight, so. And I just put my hair in a roller because I just wanted my hair out of my face and the blowouts lasted, so we're happy about that. Getting ready now, just popped open a Kathy mom water. Mm -hmm. Tell everyone what we're doing. I'm looking at myself while I do this. Yes, yeah, it's recording. I'm looking at myself and doing this. So we are going somewhere. What do you want me to say? Tell them where we're going, what we're doing. We're going to Soho House, which I'm really excited about because it's like a private thing or something. I don't know. Anyway, it sounds fabulous and beautiful. We're meeting Caitlin and Delaney there, which I love and adore. So I get a total girls night out. And then we're going dancing. <laughs> at um maybe common grounds maybe common grounds but who knows and i don't care because i just love to dance so you crushing it showing the outfit yes. i literally would wear this whole outfit so good um here's my outfit um wearing this bodysuit from shop ambitionist some of the jewelry from my collection with electric picks jacket is lamarck with the little shoulder pads i love it she's like a little crop jacket Crop, that was a crispy R. And then jeans are Abercrombie, belt Orium Collective, just a little black booty. And yeah, we're giving her the typical girls night out in New York, at least my typical girls night out in New York. Um, and I'm really excited. fun last night I'm using one of these ice cube things it's the most beautiful day and I will revive but I am just I just started the show the OC on Hulu because last night Caitlin was telling me that I should watch that we had the best night we went to So House and then we actually went to Common Ground because I just have really fun music to dance to um and we had the best time my mom thrived Everyone, all these guys would like go up to my mom and be like, happy Mother's Day. It was so funny. Yeah, my mom was meeting a friend this morning anyways um, at this art gallery in the Upper East Side. So I have the morning to myself. She was like, you need to clear up. So I'm gonna go. I was like, okay. Ooh, now I'm cold. But that did feel good. I want to do the thing where you like put your face in an ice bucket, but I can't get my lashes wet yet for another, like you're not supposed to get your lashes wet for 24 hours. So I can't yet. Okay, roll reversal. <laughs> so now my mom's tired from her museum day as she should. So now she wants to rest and I'm like finally revived spring chicken, ready to go outside. So we're gonna do a little switch spots. She's gonna now take my spot on the couch. 
It's that midday slump, I get it. I just see so many people outside walking and I'm like, I wanna be a part of society. So I did my makeup even, <sighs> that's pretty crazy. Um, and I'm gonna go to CVS and buy a Gatorade because that sounds really nice. Um, and then I'm going to maybe buy coffee after that. <laughs> and I'm gonna walk around with my two beverages with my AirPods in, listening to music. And maybe I'll pop into like Zara. I wanted to walk to the water, but I also might not. I don't know. I've got my walking shoes on in case. This is my little outfit of the day. I don't even want to tell you guys what time it is. It's so embarrassing. It feels like the morning, but it's not. Because it's chilly out there, my mom said. I'm wearing my favorite a gold day jeans. Actually, this is an a gold day tank top. Jacket is Lamarck. Clearly, I have a thing for Lamarck jackets. They're so warm and cozy. And then I'm just wearing some sneakers. And we're gonna just go explore a little bit. We're gonna enjoy today. But tonight we have dinner and a show. She's truly experiencing my perfect weekend formula. Mm. I finally can drink water. This morning I like wasn't able to drink water. And it's so good now. I'm so happy. Oh, yes. Bye bye. <laughs> Out. I'm just walking around, bopping into stores while my mom naps. Fun. Apparently there's a portal to Dublin over by Madison Square Park, like Flatiron. So I'm gonna go check it out and see if it's open. Like basically it's like a, a camera that people in Dublin can walk up to and we see them and then they see us. So it's not a real portal. But I think that's so cute and just bringing communities together. So I wanna go, I have the hiccups all the time. I wanna go see if it's in action. Guys, I think I found it. Oh my gosh. This is so cute, you guys. Everyone's looking at the portal. A little coffee here. So sweet. I love this. This is happy. My mom would have loved this. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that was so cool. I'm so glad now. I'm just in Madison Square Park. So beautiful. Everyone's out and about. Having their lunch, their little picnics. It's very cute. Now I've come across a little food fair. Corn on the cob that actually sounds so good. Should I send it? <laughs> Guys, I kind of want some corn. I decided against the corn because we have dinner in like an hour and a half, two hours, because we have an early dinner before our musical we're seeing tonight. So I said no to the corn on the cob. <laughs> back for my walk and now we're getting ready so fast for dinner and a show we are going so bar preemie is one of my favorite oh, restaurants in the city like literally when people come i tell them to go there and they just opened a new location in on west 33rd street which is pretty close to the show we're going to so i was like this is perfect but we literally have to go because that's the thing when you're going to an eight o'clock show then you need to get like six o'clock dinner my outfit is honestly giving business like a little too business but it's just too late oh my god it's like so business but i i literally <laughs> look like i'm going to a conference um not my proudest moment at all actually oh my god i wonder if i should put on jeans instead i feel like i need to switch to jeans like i actually look like i'm in a pantsuit but like not in the cool girl bossy way like you look so chic sophia richie grange no, but like it's a lot of black. Should I put? I feel like I should put on the jeans. No, or should I keep it? What are you gonna feel good in? I mean, I feel good in this, but then I look at it and I'm like. But are you looking at yourself online? Or are you feeling yourself? No, but I have to feel myself. But then you, at dinner, you're gonna take this jacket off. Let I me need just the put jeans. The jacket. Okay. Okay, I switched to the jeans. Honestly, this is a terrible outfit, and I'm so sorry that you all have to look at this. This is the best it's gonna get. It's not my proudest moment. But we're gonna go. She looks great. You look great. <laughs> and that's important. <laughs> Wait, this is adorable. This looks nothing like. Oh, so there's a courtyard.
today. Oh my gosh! We're doing a matching, I got us a ton of matching outfits and we're so tempted to wear it to brunch. We're doing a little Instagram reel where I got us a ton of matching outfits because is, Mother's Day. It is total Mother's Day morning with this gal. Not sipping, relaxing tea, no, we got stuff to we do. We got stuff to do. <laughs> Outfit number two. This is so cute, I love I this. <laughs> Outfit number three. I love it. Twinsies. Outfit number four. Here she goes. Here she goes. Best for last, my oh. favorite one. And I'm wearing it for Mother's Day. I know, day. I'm like, oh, I wanna wear it. <laughs> but we just simply can't wear it out. Like, oh, it would be cute. It would be so cute, but I just am not in the mood. <laughs> just finished filming our little video. Here's my outfit of the day for Mother's Day. We're gonna go to brunch at this place called Claudette that I've been wanting to go to and then walk around a little bit. So here's my outfit for that. My mom didn't even need to pick out an outfit because she just used the one that we ended off in our reel. Um, but yeah, top is Revolve, jeans are Abercrombie, belt is Oram. Throw over this jacket because it's just cold out. I can't believe it's cold out. So frustrating. But yeah, it's like rainy, so I feel kind of gross, but we're gonna make the best of it. Okay, we're here. No one else is sitting outside. It was supposed to be a beautiful sunny day and this place is a vibe. But he was like, do you guys want to be in there? I said, no, I want to be out here because we're under a thing. So he goes, do you want to be in the heated box? I don't want to be in like a hot box. Like, <laughs> but I was like, mom, it's your day, so. But it's my day, but we know we need the- Well, then you were like, but where are you? No, I get it because then we're sitting like right here. Yeah, then we're like people watching that and there it's just- It's a box. No, this is No, better. this is comfortable. It's okay, fine. good. You let me know. I would tell you if I really Perfect. did. We're going to start a trend. Just you guys wait by the end of this vlog. Just me people here. We are the trend. We are the trend. We're having fun no matter where we are. Claudette, dead. Mother's Day 2024. I'm walking here. village now she wanted to walk around cozy area oh it's like definitely raining I need to pull out my umbrella but cute little West Village Sunday this is literally me you guys when I like my outfit I'm a lot more pleasant to be around I'm trying in dresses right now Yummy Magnolia Bakery. Ah, oh, I've never been in here. This is so yummy. I like the chocolate cupcake with the vanilla, or the vanilla cupcake with the chocolate frosting. Yummy! Yeah. I know! I love it! Wow. Mmm. Mom left about an hour ago. She's at the airport. She's having her main character moment. Um, I sent her off with lots of goodies and hugs and I'm so happy she got to be here this weekend. It was so fun, but it is Sunday after all and I still need to have my Sunday reset. So I've got the laundry in. I just took off all my makeup, put on lots of skincare, put on a walking outfit. I already have like 5,000 steps today. So I'm like, let's get to 10K steps. So I just texted Caitlin and I said, do you want to go for a walk along West Side Highway? And she said, yes. So it's so beautiful out. Even though it was raining earlier, now the sun's coming out. I feel like the sunset's gonna be really nice. Um, and I'm due for a West Side Highway walk. So we're gonna do that and then I'll come back and make some dinner and have a cozy night in. Um, so yeah, this is the fit. This jacket is from Park. Leggings, sneakers, you guys already kind of know. I'm like, do I need to be wearing this hat? Is it too much? Should I do ears out or not ears out, but like, I just think it's cute when you can see my earrings, but I just feel so hidden. I don't know. Yeah, I think I, I think I like this. I'm gonna go pick up Caitlin and we're gonna go for a walk. I'm excited. Okay, we've ended up at Rosemary's at the bar. Cheers. We're meeting up with Ryan and some friends for dinner. Well, this is 
just turn of events. Not actually, I'm not that crazy, but Kayla and I were on our walk. Ryan called me, he like just landed from the airport and he's like, do you wanna get dinner with me, Luke and Ty? Um, one of our good friends that's like in town from Georgia. And Caitlin knows all those guys cause like me, Caitlin and Luke went to high school together. Long story short, Caitlin and I were like, honestly, I'm so hungry. I was gonna cook tonight and have a wholesome night, but ended up going to Rosemary's. But it was so fun. We walked to Magnolia Bakery after cause they wanted it. I was like, you guys are kidding me. I was here earlier, so I didn't get anything. I was so full, but went to Magnolia with them. And then we just all walked back and it was just a really nice night. It was a fun like, oh, I guess we'll just do this. Like I felt so underdressed in Rosemary's in this, but it was really fun. And I love all those guys and being with Caitlin. So yeah, but now my, <coughs> my laundry's been sitting here all wet, waiting to get put into the dryer. Cause I thought I'd be gone for like an hour and a half, but I was gone. It's now 10, 15 and I left at like 6.30. <laughs> so I'm just gonna continue to clean and then go to bed here soon. I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend in my life. It was so fun, it was very well-rounded. New York City weekend and I had so much fun with my mom and I'm so glad I got to share all that with you guys. So thanks for supporting always. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time for the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.